Under Article 23 of the Gene Technology Act, the Swiss Federal Ethics Committee on Non-Human Biotechnology ECNH is an extra-parliamentary advisory committee, appointed to advise the Federal Council and the Federal and Cantonal Authorities on matters of regulations and enforcement of legislation in the field of non-human biotechnology. The Federal Council established the ECNH by decree on 27 April 1998. It is administratively attached to the Federal Office for the Environment in the Department of Environment, Transport, Energy and Communications. Topic. Mandate. The ECNH monitors and evaluates developments in and applications of non-human biotechnology and comments from an ethical perspective on the scientific and social questions arising in this connection. It advises a. The Federal Council on the Introduction of Regulations b. The Federal and Cantonal Authorities on Matters of Enforcement in particular, it shall comment on license applications or research projects of fundamental or exemplary importance. For this purpose, it may inspect documents, request information, and consult other experts. It collaborates with other federal and cantonal committees concerned with questions of biotechnology. It engages in a dialogue with the public on ethical issues associated with biotechnology. It reports to the Federal Council periodically on its activities. Members <inaudible> 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 The ECNH consists of 12 members from a range of disciplines, either specialists in ethics or coming from other fields but with a scientific or practical knowledge of ethics. Various ethical approaches also need to be represented in a balanced manner. The members of the committee are appointed by the Federal Council for a term of four years. Klaus Peter Ripp Chair, Professor of Practical Philosophy and Principal of the University of Education Karlsruhe, Germany, Director of Ethic I M Diskurs, Zurich. Marcus Arnold, Lecturer of Ethics and Director of Studies at the Institute of Religious Education, University of Lucerne. Monica Betzler, Chair in Practical Philosophy at the Ludwig Maximilians Universität München Christine Clavian, Maitre d'enseignement et de recherche of Philosophy, Institut Ethique Histoire Humanités, University of Geneva Eva Gelling C, research assistant at Prospeciorara, staff member of the initiative for GE Free Seeds and Breeding IG Satgut. Greta Garda, assistant professor of biology at the Faculty of Biology and Medicine, University of Lausanne. Gerald Hess, maître d'enseignement et de recherche of Ethics and Environmental Philosophy at the Faculty of Geosciences and the Environment, University of Lausanne Toso Lieb, Professor of Veterinary Medicine Genetics and Animal Breeding, Director of the Institute of Genetics, Vetsuisse Faculty, University of Bern Matthias Malman, Chair of Legal Theory, Legal Sociology and International Public Law at the Faculty of Law, University of Zurich. Jean Marc Newhaus, Professor of Biochemistry and Molecular Biology, University of Neuchâtel. Otto Schaefer, Responsible for Theological and Ethical Questions at the Federation of Swiss Protestant Churches SEK, FEPS, Bern. Marcus Wilde, Professor of Theoretical Philosophy at the Philosophy Department, University of Basel. 
Topic: Secretariat. The committee is assisted by a scientific secretariat, which reports to the chair of the committee and is administratively attached to the Federal Office for the Environment (FOEN). Topic: Publications. Topic: The most important statements issued by the committee. The Dignity of Animals, a joint statement by the Federal Ethics Committee on Non-Human Biotechnology (ECNH) and the Swiss Committee on Animal Experiments (SCAE) concerning a more concrete definition of the dignity of creation with regard to animals, 2001. Patents on Animals and Plants, a Contribution to Discussion, 2001. Gene Technology for Food, Ethical Considerations for the Marketing of Genetically Modified Foodstuffs and Animal Feed, 2003. Gene Technology and Developing Countries, a Contribution to the Discussion from an Ethical Perspective, 2004. Research on Primates, an Ethical Evaluation, Report by the Swiss Committee on Animal Experiments SCAE and the Swiss Ethics Committee on Non-Human Biotechnology ECNH, 2006. The Dignity of Living Beings with Regard to Plants. Moral Consideration of Plants for Their Own Sake, 2008. Synthetic Biology. Ethical Considerations, 2010 Release of Genetically Modified Plants, Ethical Requirements, 2012 Ethical Treatment of Fish, 2014 Freedom of Research and Biosecurity, Ethical Considerations by the Example of Dual-Use Research of Concern, 2015 in German and French only New Plant Breeding Techniques, Ethical Considerations, 2016 Betrage zur Ethik und Biotechnologie series Expert reports commissioned by the ECNH which are of interest to a wider audience are published in the original language in a series entitled Betrage zur Ethik und Biotechnologie Contributions to Ethics and Biotechnology. These reports provide a basis for consideration of the ethical aspects of biotechnology and serve as working papers for the ECNH. Volume 1, Andreas Bachmann, Nano Bio Technology, Eine ethische Ausleitung, Nano Bio Technology, an Ethical Review, 2006. Volume 2, Jörg Stocklin, Die Pflanze, Moderne Konzepte der Biologie, The Plant, Modern Biological Concepts, 2007. Volume 3, Andreas Brenner, Leben, Eine philosophische Untersuchung, Life, A Philosophical Investigation, 2007. Volume 4, Benjamin Rath, Ethik des Risikos, Begriff, Situationen, Entscheidungstheorien und Aspekte, Ethics of Risk, Concepts, Situations, Decision Theories and Other Aspects, 2008. Volume 5, Joachim Bolt, Oliver Muller, Giovanni Mayo, Synthetische Biologie, Eine ethische philosophische Analyse Synthetic Biology, An Ethical and Philosophical Analysis, 2009. Volume 6, Bernard Bertschi. La vie artificielle. La statute moral des êtres vivants artificiels, 2009. 
Volume 7, Ariana Ferrari, Christopher Conan, Armin Grunwald, Arnold Sauter, Animal Enhancement, Neue Technische Möglichkeiten und Ethische Fragen, 2010. Volume 8, Peter Kunzmann, Nikolaus Nopfeller, Primaten, IHR Moralischer Status, 2011. Volume 9, Helmut Segner, Fish, Nociception and Pain. A Biological Perspective, 2012. Volume 10, Marcus Wilde, Fish, Cognition, Bewusstsein und Schmerz. Eine Philosophische Perspective, 2012. Volume 11, Biosecurity und Publicationsfreiheit, die Verifenlichung Heikeler Forschungsdaten im Spannungsfeld von Freiheit und Sicherheit. Eine Grundrechtliche Analyse, 2014. Miscellaneous <inaudible> 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 In October 2008, the ECNH was awarded the IG Nobel Prize for the publication of The Dignity of Living Beings with Regard to Plants, Moral Consideration of Plants for Their Own Sake. <laughs> External links Website of the Federal Ethics Committee on Non-Human Biotechnology Swiss Federal Extra-Parliamentary Commissions in German, French or Italian The Federal Authorities of the Swiss Confederation The Gene Technology Act GTA, in German, French or Italian